What's going on YouTube? Welcome to my channel, A Journey to the Fitness. Um, I have an interesting video for you this week. It's going to be talking about this, this, how this week went, where my mind was at, and actually I'm going to talk about next week, especially tomorrow. I'm going to get into that. First, we're going to talk about um, diet-wise. My nutrition this week, I, f I, I feel like I'm hitting it every week, but there's something that's happening that I'm really not excited for. Um, and I have stopped doing cardio at this point, um, just because of, uh, I'm taking, uh, advice from, uh, Michael Hearn, who, uh, basically said that people, certain people, and I have noticed a difference, uh, they do cardio so much that they burn themselves out, and then they, they can't gain any, anything on, basically I was burning myself out, I was under-recovering. Um, because my body was working so hard on that cardio. I don't know if that's true. I feel like it's true. So I'm going to call that as truth. Because ever since I stopped doing as much cardio. I'm still doing cardio. But nothing like I was. Um, I've been able to lift a lot heavier in the gym. Um, I've been recovering better. So I think that that was a true true statement. By Michael Hearn. So thank you brother. Um, I'm not affiliated by anybody. I just... You know, from what I listen to, I try to learn. Uh, so I've been basically uh, stopping cardio and uh, I'm gaining a little bit of weight. I'm at 182.4. I did it off camera actually before this video. And that kind of upsets me because I think if I was going to compete, which I'm working on getting to a competition weight right now. Um, I pretty much want to w learn how to diet down, keep it there for a little bit, and then, um, you know, before I do my competition, I want to know that I can diet down. So I'm working on it, figuring out what's the best way for me. I'm at 182 right now. Like I said, I think 170 would probably be where I would want to be uh, for my competition weight. Um, but I'm having trouble. Um, I'm try I mean... Yeah, I'm having trouble uh, getting it down to the 170s. 180 seems to be I can't or I can't can't keep it under 180. Um, so I am looking into basically just different nutrition, just trying to figure it out. Um, training wise, this tomorrow I am going to try a PR of bench press. Uh, I hit bench like four times this week, which is pretty excessive um i actually maxed out at 205 four times all four times i don't generally recommend that and i don't generally do that i am trying to lift a little bit heavier because i want to make full muscle instead of just big muscle there's a difference in my mind between big muscle that looks big and then full muscle which i don't know if i can make look on this camera but i'm working on that um so I'm trying to fill myself out for that. I think I need to add a little bit more weight. So that's what I'm doing. Um, and I'm going to try 225. I've never touched that weight before. I have put it in my hands once. Um, I'm doing that tomorrow. I did not touch. Uh, I have not uh, done uh, chest or anything since Thursday. Friday I took off. Saturday I did legs. Yeah. Uh, even though I played three rounds of disc golf. But um did not train really Saturday aside from legs and Sunday or today I didn't do anything uh, chest worthy or anything because I'm trying to let myself relax from all that from lifting 205 four times last week um so I'm kind of trying to let my central nervous system relax um so yeah uh, I'm gonna try to PR on bench press hit 225 I may try 350 on deadlift soon. I'll probably wear a belt my first time. I don't like wearing belts. In fact, I did 315 for three three sets of one earlier this week. Mm -hmm. um, and it wasn't super bad. It was definitely hard, but it wasn't super bad. Um, I also did the Zercher squat. I did 135 on Zercher squat, which is my first time ever doing Zercher squat. And I had to actually keep them on pads because I couldn't get all the way down because I was trying to do the deadlift version that I saw. That I really actually do like. 
Um, but I definitely need to work on my flexibility. I have some other uh, things I threw in this week to try to get me there. Um, I got those from Juji Mufu uh, and Meg Squats. Uh, I do like um, the exercise they put in there. It's an interesting ex. The, the two that I the, the two that I uh, incorporated this week were very interesting. I think I'm gonna have to throw them in. Uh, one of them is really good for flexibility, and then one of them is just uh, the Zercher squat. I don't really know how to explain the Zercher squat. Squat. S squat. I cannot talk. Um, but I'm definitely gonna be throwing those in because they're just. They're an interesting exercise that I really, really actually enjoy. So, um, I'm going to be throwing those in. But, uh, I think I'm going to go for my deadlift 350, uh, soon. And I also think maybe in a few weeks I'll try 250 on squat. I did not really squat this week. Uh, I was doing, uh, bottom squats, which is you put them on the rack and you explode up. Uh, I'm trying to, like I said, I'm trying to gain some strength and some muscle, uh, to make fuller muscles, and I'm trying this method, seeing if it works for me. I'm also doing my volume and things like that, so that's kind of how my training's changing right now, is I'm gonna go a little bit heavier, um, and try some heavier, some heavier exercises to see if I can gain, um, uh, fuller muscles, not so much bigger muscles, and I definitely don't want to really gain weight. I actually want to drop weight, um, which I know I need a calorie sur a, a small calorie surplus in it. Um, I'm really trying to figure that out between the deficit, the maintenance, and the uh, surplus, because you know, yeah, I want to gain. I, I want to be competition ready, and I think 170 is where it is. And I'm pretty much just spinning my wheels right now. At least that's what it feels like. But that's okay because that's part of the journey. And I'm actually going to set my camera up there and do a little pose down. I haven't done a pose down in a while. I want to kind of keep track of what I'm doing. And the lighting's going to be really, really bad. But you know, you got to work with what you got. So. I've gotten wider. Yeah, this lighting's really bad. I don't even want to pose. Um, but, so that's my physique. From the back, I look pretty good. I don't know if you can see because of the lighting. But my back is really coming in. So, that's my physique at the moment. Like I said, I feel like I'm spinning my wheels. But, I'm trying different things. And I'm in no rush to reach my goal. Uh, this goal for 225 has been 10 years. The 250 squat's been 5 years, I think. And the 350 deadlift has been, I don't even know. Not 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 super long, because I didn't deadlift a lot when I started working out. But we're working on it, guys. And I just wanted to give you a quick update on, the, on uh, how my week went. So, I'm going to settle in for the night and uh, watch some anime and get ready for tomorrow. So, peace.